invented football. Created a rare commodity. Watch the ball! Come on, see the ball! A game that can actually bond men. Players, coaches, even the referees. A little extra time with dad is always, always good. Troy Gilroy and his dad have a date every Friday night. He's the headlinesman, and we're right across the line from each other, so we, we work hand in hand pretty much the whole game. Yeah, talk about it on the weekend when you get together, things that happen. It's rare enough that two guys with the same last name can wear stripes. Not many people get a chance to do that. It's even wilder when it happens twice. Moved back to Perry in 2000 and then uh, started right up that fall with him. Two fathers and two sons on one field for four fall seasons. He went down in the third quarter. Heads is the call. Until last October. He handed me his hat and says, I've got to sit down. While officiating a game, Dennis Roberts, Brett's dad, started having chest pains. And all of a sudden they loaded him up in an ambulance and took him to the hospital. For the first time in years, Brett found himself on the field without his father. Still first out. Still first. He was in intensive care for a month and uh, finally died in November. Two men who had been together for decades but bonded between the football field lines this fall. It hurt. A week ago, we had an ambulance come on the field, and I know it really bothered our referee. The man who inherited more than just his white hat from his dad. This is his flag. I, I carry this flag with me every week. I haven't officiated a football game where I haven't had his penalty flag in my back pocket. I never throw it, but it's always in my back pocket. Along with a million memories of Friday nights with his father. Mothers and daughters have their own thing, and fathers seem to have uh, sports. <laughs> Bad girl.